Good. <clears throat> What's happening? How's it going? It's okay. Anything about opening night that surprised you? Um, no, nah, not really. Other than being in a different locker room than I ever been in. <laughs> When Steph was about to go in, you went over there and said something to him at the score and said, were you just trying to keep him loose, that kind of thing? Like, <laughs> no, I was just telling him the jersey rule. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah, a lot of guys don't know, you know what I'm saying? Like most, most guys warm up with their jersey untucked, right? And so you go to check in in the game with your jersey untucked and it's a delay of game, right? So now if a guy shoot the ball and catch the ball out the net, now you get a free throw. They had a rookie here, I won't, I won't name, but like the first second he checked in the game, it was technical because he had his shirt untucked. Yeah, it's, it's cool. Like, he ain't supposed to know. <laughs> you know. True. On the floor, what did you see from your team today? Man, um, you know, it's funny. Like, we didn't, even through preseason, um, Vic missed a game or two. I missed a game or two. We didn't have guys sort of in and out. But, uh, man, I loved the fight that we showed, you know. There's no moral victories, but we played against a team that went to the Western Conference. Uh, I mean, that won, the, that went to the finals. You know what I mean? So there's a continuity that they have, you know, but I, I think for me, not knowing what to expect, preseason is one thing, the regular season is another thing, but I'm honestly so excited about the spurts that I've seen and, and what I know is capable of our team. What did you see from Vic in particular today? <laughs> I mean, you see something different every game, you know, and I think uh, there's a learning curve for me, for sure, but also for other guys, you know, playing with a guy who can be that close to the rim, handle the ball, you know, I'm setting screens and I'm rolling. And I think as we all get more time, we will figure each other out. You were talking about that continuity that Dallas has. Is that a thing that takes pretty much a whole season to get to? Or like well, you hope it doesn't. <laughs> you know, you hope it doesn't take a, a whole season. You know, you just, throughout the game, you know, you, you, you have success with certain things, and then guys be like, okay, this sort of works. This sort of works. And when they went on that run, we got to figure out what are we, what are we going to run to sort of settle everybody down. That team over there, they knew. Right. You know, if we went on a run, let's slow it down. Let's get Luca coming off a handoff. Let's get uh, Kyrie with a live dribble. So. That'll be a, a process for us, but we talked about in the locker room, the goal is to learn all that stuff and win at the same time. <laughs> it's always nice to win and learn at the same time. It's a pretty, pretty strong atmosphere out there for opening night, too, as well. I mean, in, yeah. in the third quarter, I, I think when they extended into double digits, you were out there with Julian, Jeremy, Vic, and Kelton, all guys under the age of 25. And there was a possession, I remember you were inbounding the ball and you were kind of calling for somebody to sort of help you out. In those kind of moments on in road games like that, can you find sort of some, some teaching moments? I, I, don't, I don't even remember that play, um, but there was a lot of them during the game and I got to be better as far as the turnovers and learning to cut through and all of this. But um, I, I like that we got to got a chance to play in this atmosphere, right? I think we're gonna have a lot more games like that this year. But um, like I said, I'm, I'm excited about um, the stretches that we showed tonight. Chris, what about Julian? What he brings on both sides of the floor? Man, Drew, I, I have such expect, high expectations for him, you know. But a lot of guys, uh, Drew, um, Jeremy, all these guys, man, our, our team, we really got some players. And I think we're starting to figure out that we can all help each other be the best version of ourselves, right? Like Malachi, Malachi didn't play much tonight, but every time he shoot it, I expect it to go in. Drew passed up one shot on the wing tonight, and I was pissed, you know, because day in and day out, when you see guys and the way that they practice, and Drew can really shoot that ball, and so we're going to need him to do that. Interaction, last week, interaction between you and Coach Pop for the first time in a regular season game. What, what was that sort of dynamic like with, between you two? Out it, was cool. it was cool. Um, it's, it's, it's cool just to see how his mind is working and the fact that we can talk and we can communicate. And he got on my ass in one of those uh, timeouts, and you just appreciate it because I know how bad he wants to win. 
you know, as long as he's been doing this, he's so competitive and I'm the same way. You know, so it's it's cool to be on the same same side of it. What did you get on your ass for? Um I think it wasn't cutting, or it was a turnover, it was something. There's a whole lot of stuff I need to do better, but we 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 definitely gonna get better at it as I I definitely will. Thanks, sir. Thank no you. problem. Thanks, guys. No problem. Who's gonna go first? Did you uh, see anything out there that surprised you for an opening night? Any, anything else to that? Oh, uh, you know, I thought. Um, I thought we showed some character um, in the second half, obviously going up against some adversity there at the beginning of the third, uh, getting down. I thought we did a good job, you know, for our group to just just battle back. Uh, a lot of different things we can learn from from tonight. But, uh, you know, this is the, the first step in the journey. Coach was just saying earlier that you guys are your best when you play with pace. You guys need to play with pace. Is that something where uh, coming into tonight you guys kind of understood that assignment or is that like a work in progress sort of thing? No, I think we, we understood playing with pace. I thought, especially in the first half, we were a little stagnant with the ball. Um, you know, obviously playing in good defensive teams, you know, they're going to be able to load up and make things difficult. But I think when guys just play loose, play with confidence, um, you know, trust their instincts, I think that's just something that, you know, we're just going to, as a group, grow into and just trust that, you know, guys are going to make the right play. For you personally, did it feel good? You know, we've, we've been pestering you about your shot all preseason to know that when the lights come on, it was there for you again? Well, I, I think I said the other day, you know, uh, I wasn't worried. And um, I wasn't, I mean, obviously this group, um, we have a lot of talent offensively. Guys are going to be able to draw to um, create open shots, things like that. So, you know, I know my job is, is pretty simple. Just make the right reads and keep the game, keep the game simple. No, I saw Clay's game tonight. Yeah, I mean, obviously, um, you know, he's been doing it his entire career. You know, I thought we could have done a better job of uh, trying to make him work for his baskets. But you know, when you leave a, a Hall of Famer open for threes, you know, he's gonna he's gonna knock him in. He does that at a high clip. Thanks, HB. Thanks. Thank you. Well, he's uh, you know someone who's gained confidence each year, and finally has bought in totally to catch and shoot kind of things from the three-point line, and that's important for us. So his shooting is uh, really his biggest improvement. And I think defensively, he's made a, a half a step forward because he knows, uh, you know, we got to start, we not start, but we have to concentrate defensively on stopping people because we didn't do that very well until the, about the last 12 games last year. Game shape aside, I might have made a mistake there, but what did you think of Victor overall? Uh, he was fine. Okay, thank you. Thanks. Thank you.